What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to a brand new episode of Modern Unturned. I believe today we have episode number 170, possibly, or episode 169. I'm not 100% sure on which one it is. We are on a new video, and today we're on a brand new Russian server. I know I pretty much say that every single time, but today we're on a kind of a weird server. So, so far, I got an M60, I got a Composition C4. Just look at this airdrop. There's like a base completely destroyed here, and inside the airdrop, up here is all these charges and the detonator, and on the ground, and Underneath the airdrop was two generators and two neutral sentries. So I don't know what's going on on the server. I'm not even sure there's going to be any bases. I mean, I've seen this and it's rated like pretty much destroyed. Like it's gone. So we're going to see if there is uh, anything we can raid here. If you guys enjoy these type of videos or if you like any of the videos you've seen in the past, if you could subscribe, that would be really awesome. Also, if you enjoy the video, leave a like and a comment. That would help me out a lot and I'd appreciate it. I got a kit. Like, it's called Kit PvP 6 or something, and I got this big AK. This AK is massive. Like, look how giant this is compared to, like, everything else. It's a bit ridiculous. So I'm not sure if we're gonna be able to find anything to raid on this server. I see something over there, maybe a rock. But, uh, I'm gonna run this way, and then we're gonna run the other side of the map up. It is a modded server. It is a normal server, meaning the zombies are normal. But I just shot a bunch of zombies with this, uh, Viper I got from the starter kit, and it didn't decay. So I don't think weapon decays on this server, which is good. Meaning that everything should stay at 100% the entire time we're playing, which is awesome. The chances of us finding anything to raid on this server though are probably very low because of how easily i just got stuff to raid i doubt there's gonna be anything for me to raid but you never know and i'm going to uh to look everywhere i possibly can we're gonna check the airport probably gonna be nothing there but it's worth a check you never know as i said in the last video i can't go under the map anymore and i'm playing by myself once again so which bases are kind of out of the question for now Oh, there's an airdrop. I don't know. Depending where it goes, I'll go for it. Yeah, so glitch base is out of the question. Whenever Hans returns to play with me, or if uh, one of you guys run into me in the server, or if I do like a sub play thing, at that point, glitch bases will be back into question. So if you guys are wondering if I ever play with people, I think from now on, if I need somebody, if I need somebody's help, like to do a raid, like if it's too insane for me to do by myself, or I need help glitching, I'm just going to ask people in my Discord. So if you guys have enjoyed my Discord already, Ready, you definitely should link for that is down in the description make sure i look at the prison so basically every time i go to the prison it feels like and look i feel like i see uh well, well the last couple times i went to the prison there was a sky base and it turned out to be a sky arena i touched upon that last episode if there's a sky base on this russian server depending on how it's uh... what is this <laughs> Well, they have a floating base. Okay, well, let's go check this out. But if you see a sky base, I'm very skeptical. So even anything over here, this is cars? I don't understand what I'm looking at right now. Oh. No? Okay, they're off. Okay, yeah, it's definitely multiplied health in here, boys. This pie attack is a good gun. I don't know if it raids on the server. Let's see if we can break this. Let's use the uh, composition C4. Uh, I think I made a mistake. I don't know how I'm going to reach that. Where's go Okay, I can't even jump to it. We're going to try to make some of these composition C4s. I need, uh... Okay, I need explosives and I need glue. I need a wire and a blowtorch. That's not too bad. Yeah, we're going to have to hit up all the airdrops so we can get some charges. I wonder if they're that common that they come in every single airdrop. I don't know. I don't know what that says. I'm gonna... Scrap this gun so I can make some metal plates. Look how much stuff you need just to make one of these. You need a vaccine, a morphine, purification tablets, two antibiotics, one med kit, two blueberries, a chemical, an MRE just to craft that. I don't understand what's going on with that. Oh, I wonder why this isn't doing damage because it takes regular military ammo.
There's a blowtorch right there. I need to get to it somehow. I need to scrap something. Something in my inventory needs to be scrappable, please. Whatever, we'll scrap that if we have to. It's okay. Let's make a small... Let's make a sheet and then a small metal plate. Oh! It's one of these servers where plates are banned. Okay. I see how it's gonna be. There's a rocket in there. And I can't take it. I'm just gonna have to get another floor, aren't I? I don't have anything to chop a tree with, though. Three blowtorches. A vault door. I'll put a charge soon. I don't know. Airdrops are. I don't think it should be too hard to get charges. We'll save these two. We'll see if we can break. Okay, nice. Uh, a rocket launcher. It was worth it. And a combat vest. Use a rocket launcher. Got a rocket launcher with three rockets total. Okay, we'll rip the floor once again. I'll put one on each. We'll risk it. We have rating stuff, so it shouldn't be too hard to get more. Is that another rocket? Three more rockets. Yeah, it was worth Okay, let's jump down and see if there's anything down here in the water. There is stuff down here in the water. Heavy class military vest. DSR 50 with like six mags. Anything else over here in the water? What is that? Night vision? Nope. Who knows if there's gonna be anything else here to raid? But if there is, we'll continue raiding on this server. If not, we'll probably swap to a different one because this one's kind of an interesting start. So I'm here on the second server of the video. I found this helicopter in Washington with 100% everything after running around for a while. And I decided to fly around the map looking to see if I could find anything. And I found this. Um, a pretty huge sky base that looks like it's currently being built. It's a 5x5x2 five by five by and there's another sky base over there. So I just landed so I could do the intro, but, uh, or I, I, not really the intro because it's the second part of the video, but I guess it kind of is the intro to the server. I'm gonna fly up there. I only have 12% gas, so I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get back down once I get up. But I do have a bedroll, so we can see if we can put it up there. Oh no. Okay, there's Toxicity Megas over there. There's a... Um... A Sentries? I don't think they're on, though. They have Dragon Fangs in them! Can we break this with a knife? Let's see how the health is on the server, boys. Let's shoot it. Two shots, plus a couple knives. Two shots. I think it's normal health. All right, I'm gonna jump down here. If I die, I die. I don't really have anything to lose. Okay, we're raiding today, boys. Let me break this claim flag. And I'm gonna put my bed down over here. Please tell me I'm able to put the bed down. Yes. I don't know if there's gonna be anything in here, but there was toxicities in the back side of it. Now that I can no longer get to them, because there's probably claim flags inside the base as well. And there was a little base on the hill. I don't know what it is behind this door, but it's completely black and I can't see anything. Let me make sure I claim the bed. Let's hop down. We're not losing any oxygen. We're not high enough to the point to lose oxygen. So let me make sure it's claimed. And we're going to jump down and we're going to go loot. I'm going to go to military base. We're not that far away. I would take the helicopter, but I unfortunately don't have a gas can or anything. I kind of just did a little bit of minor looting. That's basically what I do. I just uh, do a little bit of loot, light looting. Walk around, see if there's anything for us to raid. Oh, is that modded metal on the inside? I think it is. You guys see that? Okay. Well, it's going to be a little bit tougher than we thought, but hopefully we're able to raid. We need to get something to break those dragon fangs down. There's two dragon fangs in those sentries. Possibly even more sentries inside, who knows? So we're going to have to see what we can do. We're going to run to military base, maybe? It is a five times loot server. I haven't really killed too many zombies. I've just been picking up loot off of spawns, like car crashes and stuff like that so far. We're going to see what happens today, boys. Hopefully there's more loot than there was in the last server. Even though the last server was pretty good. The helicopter is kind of like a big giveaway that's how i uh saw the base because usually i don't really check there i don't check paradise point too often because not many people build there especially a huge sky base like that it's kind of random but it is what it is if we can get two grenades right now we could probably just straight up start raiding depending on how much health there is on the actual structures because it took two shots to break a uh 
what's it called, a claim flag, and that's kind of usual, that's like a usual amount, two shots, I don't really know how many knives, I should probably test that in single player one day, if we can get two grenades, there's one grenade, we do have, uh, military frag ammo, I'm not sure if that works for breaking sentries, people have been telling me this entire time that I can raid with this, so, maybe we'll try it today, if we can get a, um, what is that, 12 gauge shotgun crate, 20 shells, 12 gauge, alright, let me loot this car crash, and we're gonna go home, and we're gonna see if you guys are right the entire time, if I can raid with military fragmentation ammo. Like, it's kind of like a Mythbusters thing for me. Because at this point, I have... What is that in the road? Is that a person? Oh, it's sheep. Okay, so more farming mods on this server. I didn't know that. Whatever, let's just go back because we're already here. Let's go home. Let's see if you guys are right. I'm going to see, first of all, if this is unlocked. It is. And it has ammo in it, but it has no... Is this gas? Whoever told me that you can raid with that, I think you're wrong, dude. I don't think you can actually raid with that. Oh, maybe you can. Let's get this one as well. We'll see if this is enough to snowball our raid. I don't know if we're going to be able to uh, fully raid. What is this metal? It's like gloss or satin black. Dude, I don't know what kind of metal this is. Should I try to shoot it? It's like a pure black metal. I don't think I can raid that. Should I just go through the back and raid those lockers first? They're both unclaimed. SM1216, draw magazine shotgun with a burst fire. Okay, is that a mag for it? It is. A regular shadow stalker, a sniper, sky. I just wasted everything. I don't know what kind of metal this is. If you guys know what this is, leave it down in the comments. I don't even know if I can raid this. Is the whole thing made out of this? That's pretty smart if it is. I don't even know if you're able to raid that. It's very weird. Back to running to military base it is, boys. Let's go to Tacoma, so you can get a gas can and uh, maybe raid with the helicopter. I don't know. Depending on what kind of ammo it takes. I should probably go back and see what kind of ammo the actual box takes. Because I don't know if it's going to take low caliber. But it's whatever. We'll just see what happens. Hope you guys are enjoying the video thus far. If you are, if you like this video or you like previous videos that you saw, you guys should definitely subscribe to the channel. Statistically proven, 60% of you guys watching this video right now aren't subscribed. So I really would appreciate it if you guys could subscribe and help me uh, on the road to 70,000 subscribers. As I said earlier, if we can get a uh, Steely Wheelie and a gas can. Oh, that's very lucky. Okay. I'll take that. We could probably go back and continue raiding, maybe? Here, like, here's the thing. If I teleport back and I run out of stuff, I'm gonna have to run this way all the way again. I think I might try to get a Steely Wheelie or at least a Gas Can. Actually, I don't even need a Steely Wheelie. What am I talking about? It's unlocked. I just need a Gas Can. I'm gonna go check out this wooden base, see if it's worth raiding with this one box. Possibly there could be something in there. We got insanely lucky getting that box spawn. That's very rare to get. There's the base. I saw it flying over. See, I don't know if I want to break the toxicity or should we break into this base because there's lights on in here. Is there somebody in here? I mean, I could break into it anyway, right? <laughs> there's a bed and a table in here. That's it? We wasted like almost 30 ammo right there. Or over 30 ammo. That's okay. Let's see if we can get a gas can. I should have picked up that gas can, dude. I thought I needed a Steely Wheelie the whole time. I don't know why I was so fixated on finding a Steely Wheelie. The thing is, for the amount of mods that are on the server, I'm not really getting too much modded things. I mean, there's an industrial horde beacon, but there's our Steely Wheelie. I didn't really need it. Let's go to the other side and see if we can uh, raid it. We might have to just go up because there's nothing on that floor. I don't know. Which one was I shooting? I think this one. Yeah, it was this one. Uh, Micro, micro gun drum. Two of them. A Barret. A Warloaf. I don't even know what half of these things are. I've never seen this mod pack. Caltech RFB. Gun parts. Explosive. Okay. 
Oh, this one? I saw admin something, did I not? No, no, no. Did I not just see admin something? Or am I tripping? Let's go see if we can raid with the helicopter. Let me go get the helicopter. See what kind of ammo it takes as well. Do I have space? Oh, there's no battery in there. Dude, I'm really off today, guys. I apologize. Like, I'm not thinking clearly. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get to the other helicopter to get the battery, though. That's the problem. You guys see, like, this weird effect I get after I turn off my night vision? Do you see this? It just happened that one time. See how, like, everything glows green? What is that? Is that a graphical bug? I don't understand what that is. Whatever, let's just leave the night vision on. Maybe it's because it's raining and I have night vision? I don't know. <laughs> well, I kind of figured that was going to happen. <laughs> I think we got a bed here and we have instant teleport. At least now I don't have to walk anymore. Let me see if the gas can is still there so we can take that. I guess that explains why the battery was dead because the light was left on. Yeah, there's a gas can here. Very nice. I have 17 more shots for this too. Let's use this. Nope. I just uh, got enough to make four charges. I already made two. So I'm just going to make two more really quickly. Uh, see if we can craft this. But we can make one, two... And then, hey, at least we got a detonator, which is really good. Like, thinking back on it, we got really lucky to get the detonator. We got four charges, and we got this Serbu BFG-50, and it has one shot in it. I didn't want to waste it, because I think it, it could possibly be OP, so I'm going to use it on one of the lockers. So I did a little bit of research on what the mod could possibly be, and I went through every single mod on the list for like five minutes. I searched through all of them. I looked them up on Google to see if any of them had building things, and it's pretty much all mods that I know. The only one that had building items that I wasn't sure of, like there's toxicity building items, but it's not that because I, uh, I looked it up and it showed the picture was still the same color of like the items. So the only thing it can be is Hasgarian admin buildings. And if that's the case, that's going to be unraidable. Now, the thing is, I've come across these before, but since I've changed my settings in the game, it could be the same. It's the only type of building thing that had like a grayish, like really, really dark black tint to it, but it was see-through. Now, I think because of my settings and my video settings that I can actually, uh, it's just solid for me now. It's going to be pretty much unraidable, so let's hope that maybe like the roof is not the same type of metal. If it is is then we could probably raid from the top down but going through that metal if i know and if i think it is what it is then it's gonna be pretty much impossible so what i'm gonna do now is i'm gonna take this helicopter and i'm gonna fly over on top of the base just to see what kind of metal is in there oh we got regular metal on the top okay um guys ready for this insane pilot skills Look at that. I'm getting my pilot skills back a little bit, slowly but surely. So it looks like it's just mega regular metal on the roof, so that's definitely raidable. Definitely raidable. How long it's gonna take us to get raiding stuff, I don't know. Even the door is pure black. I don't see anything on this bottom floor though, I just see a generator. That's literally all I see, and then a staircase going up, so hopefully we could just go in from the roof down. Even if there is anything in there, I'm not sure there's gonna be anything in there, all their loot's literally outside here. If it isn't, it doesn't really make sense. Okay, let's hope and pray that we get something good to raid with. Please. Okay, let's see what we got. We got some ammo. Okay, that's a good start. Uh, low caliber military drum fits up to 100 rounds. Uh, Lynx. Wasn't this a really good sniper in Daisy mod? We already got a blowtorch. A bunch of magazines for the Lynx. Does the Lynx raid? Maybe we should test it out to see if it raids. Oh yeah, let me first of all use this. Okay, so that doesn't, uh, that doesn't work like I thought it would. Does the Lynx raid? Oh, and it does explosive damage? Let me take all these magazines. Uh, five, five, five. That's a Jeopard magazine? These are Jeopard magazines. Or Jeopard? I don't know how to say that word. 500 Nitro Express Rounds. I don't know what half these things are. I've never seen this mod pack. Dude, this thing shoots explosive rounds. It's actually sick. 
Maybe they're so weak and it ops on to use all the charges. What kind of ammo does this take? Is this even reloadable? It takes high caliber, I don't know if it's worth it. Alright, depending on how many charges it takes to blow up this toxicity, we might refill this or we'll fill the dragon fang, I'm not, I don't know. And I just walked straight off of the thing. Okay, good job, Jason. No, it didn't weaken it at all. Yeah, we're gonna use this on the dragon fang. This thing was cool, but not good enough. Hopefully, three charges is enough. Okay, here's the thing. Now we need to try to uh, shoot out these claim flags. This thing looks pretty cool too. I don't know which one I like more. Oh, cool! I missed the shot. I'm gonna try something dumb here, but it might work, so it might not be too dumb. Okay, so that's what I thought, it's the same thing on that floor. So yeah, we're gonna have to go through the roof if anything, boys. But the thing is, I'm gonna try to get up there so I can see if there's anything up there. Good thing our bed is there. We didn't lose any of our clothes. All of our stuff is here. Okay. No problem. Well, at least we got a backup helicopter. I guess my plan was 200 IQ because now we got some metal to build up with. But I don't know if it's going to be claimed on the inside. That's why I was kind of bringing the helicopter close. Trying to do like a 500 IQ plan, but it kind of backfired. Yes. Okay, the claim flags are just on the outside. Alright. Was there anything on this floor? There's absolutely nothing in here. Uh, what do I do here? Should I go up another floor? Chevy Tack, please break this. Yes! Literally on my last shot! Okay, anything on this floor? There's a room here, but there's nothing in the room. I'm glad I didn't waste time getting more stuff. At least we got to raid those lockers out there. Still that regular locker, but I guess that's pretty much it. Thank you guys so much for watching the video. If you guys want to see more of these unturned base raiding videos, definitely leave a like on this video. If you're new and you like this video, or if you like other videos you've seen, you should definitely subscribe. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Have a great day. Later.